Hi, this is Tim of the 1916 Company at Dubai Watch Week 2023 with Erwerk. Uh, created by Martin Fry Designer and Felix Baumgartner Watchmaker, Erwerk has been around since 1997. It was one of the original independents. Launching at Basel World in 1997, they presented the UR101 and the predecessor of the watch you see right here, because this is the UR102 Reloaded. So they were nicknamed respectively the 101, the Millennium Falcon, and the 102, the Sputnik. This is the Spud. It's a combination of black and steel with a titanium case back, and it actually expresses time in terms of the distance the Earth travels relative to the Sun and the distance relative to the equator that the Earth rotates. You can see the scales in between the preceding and succeeding hours. And this is a very fascinating type of satellite display. When they first started, Erver didn't show the entire carousel. They used a very traditional wandering hours type of complication. So this was the beginning of that. This, of course, is the 102 Reloaded. So it's in the image of the original. It's not the original watch. This is a more modern, better finished, more durable version of the 102. About 40 millimeters in diameter, titanium on the back, 100 piece limited edition. Now, what we also have here is the spectacular UR100 Sumerian featuring all sorts of Sumerian scripts and decorations evocative of one of the Earth's earliest civilizations and reportedly the earliest civilization to mark and tell time. So you can see the spectacular graphics on this PVD blue case with the dial to match. This was a limited edition of 30 pieces and it continues the satellite display that Erwerk first proposed in 1997 at Basel World, and it's very simple to read. You just look at the hour and then the minute scale next to it. So for example, right there, that is 7.30. As the preceding hours move off stage left, you can see the succeeding hour moves on stage right, a digital time system. Now flip it all over, you can see on the reverse, there is a regulated turbine winding system. You see the little turbine that regulates the speed of the larger rotor. The idea here is to preserve the winding system. It energizes a Zenith Elite base that gives the watch 48 hours of power reserve. There are little windows in the flanks of the case. You can see we have a bubble sapphire. Uh, one gives you the distance that the Earth rotates relative to its axis, so the distance it turns in 20 minutes, and then the other gives you the distance the Earth moves through space in the same period of time. Now finally here we have the UR230. This is the successor to the 220, and it's actually the latest addition in a line dating back to the original 201. So what's different here now is that we have this lovely Roadster-style pop top. We have the carousel that gives you the time as ever. Again, we're looking at 4.30. That's the time. All of this is luminescent. There is a little on-off indicator for the winding system. You can actually turn off the winding system to preserve it if you're very violent, very vigorous, if you're undertaking a lot of activity. And then next to it, you can see that there's actually a system showing you the degree to which the winding system has been slowed. So between full stop and full wind, there are settings that allow you to reduce its winding efficiency if you think you may be overtaxing the mechanism. Now you can also see the turbines that regulate the operation of the automatic. You can see them through the base of the dial. This is the first time that you've been able to see the turbine mechanism from the dial side. You can see that this is much more than just satellite hour. Watch the hand. It is a retrograde and satellite hour. Flip it all over. Now you can see what I'm talking about when I talk about slowing the winding system or stopping the winding system, as well as the pneumatic turbines that will act as the sort of geared winding regulator. If you cut off air to the turbines, you slow the winding action. That's how this system works. And the watch is made of a combination of CPT carbon fiber and on the bottom, blackened titanium. This is the new Erwerk UR230 here at Dubai Watch Week 2023.